can literally walk around looking like an Instagram filter in real life. And I'm gonna show you guys how to do it today. Hello my care queens, welcome back for another video. Today's video I've been super excited to film because it's more of a specific topic on how step by step I get my skin super silky, smooth, and hairless right before bed. I really think that once I started taking better care of my skin, I started to see results pretty quickly and I wanted to kind of give you guys a good video on how I get rid of my ingrown hairs, my hair in general, cellulite, stretch marks, and even strawberry legs. Please do not forget to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe down below and follow me on Instagram so that you guys can keep up with me. All right, let's get into the video. Okay, so we're gonna start off with hair removal because to me, this is the most important part of my skincare routine. So the first thing that I use is a razor. You guys can use any razor that works for you, but I look for key things in a razor. I look for something that works well with sensitive skin, something that doesn't break out my legs or my arms. I love this one right here, and I believe it's the Gillette Fusion Razor. I will put it somewhere here on the screen if I don't remember the name. You would think by now, I would remember the name of this razor since I've been using it for years. But I actually am torn between this razor and the Joy and Glee razor. You guys have seen me talk about this razor a million times. It gets rid of all of the hair that you want and it also helps prevent any razor bumps or anything like that. And I just really love this razor. So I will give myself a quick shave before doing laser and it's very important that you do that prior and it just keeps my skin looking so smooth. Okay, so today's sponsor is Kenzie. I know, you guys are probably sick of me talking about Kenzie, but listen guys, I wanted to work with them because I wanna spread the word of how good this at-home laser even is. To be honest, guys, I was super skeptical about laser hair removal. I've seen a lot of sponsored videos about this particular device, and I thought, okay, but does it even really work? But the thing is this, if you use it over time, you're going to see the stunt of hair growth. I'm not saying I'm completely hairless for life you do have to continue using it but I do not grow hair as quickly as I used to I don't know if it's my combination of being Italian and African American but when I tell you my hair grows bushy it grows bushy my leg hair I'll shave it I'll go out I'll go to sleep the next day I wake up and all of a sudden we have long leg hair again so ever since I've been using the Kenzie device I've noticed such a huge difference so this is what the device looks like up close and what I love the most about it is that it it just helps me with my hair removal process and it keeps my legs looking smooth longer, being hairless, it doesn't hurt, it's an at-home laser device so I don't have to go to a clinic and get it done. It's just all around the perfect device. This is how we do this. So I will leave everything that you guys need to know about Kenzie down below so you guys can pick it up. And I have a $50 off code. It's H-A-I, all caps, 50 for $50 off, which I think is a really great deal. So if you guys pick it up, let me know and tell me how you guys liked it. I know a lot of you guys in the past said you guys use my code and you really enjoy the device and you think it works really well. But if you're new and this is your first time watching me talk about this device, if you end up purchasing it, let me know and I wanna hear what you guys think. Okay, so moving on to body washing, I have used many, and I mean many body washes. Like I am the body wash queen. I love to try new things. But something that I've noticed about certain body washes is they're not not giving me the lather that I'm looking for. And I know sometimes lathering can be like a placebo effect and it kind of makes your brain think you're getting cleaner, better, but I need a creamy, rich, sexy lather, if you know what I mean. So what I love about Dove body soaps, and not all of them are like this, but this one in particular, is the Relaxing Lavender and Chamomile Palms and Comfort Skin Moisture Renewal. So what I love about this one is it's creamy, it's rich, it lathers for a long time. You don't have to use a lot of soap. I hate wasting product, it annoys me. I wanna feel like when I'm scrubbing my armpits, when I'm scrubbing my arms, when I'm scrubbing my legs, that it just feels like it's just continuously soaping up. Do you know what I mean? Like, have you guys ever bought a soap and it just didn't do that for you and it wasn't hitting the same and it just felt like, okay, how much more soap do I have to add for me to feel like I'm walking out of the shower smelling like soap? Because sometimes I'll feel like, was I just bathing in water the whole time? That's how it felt. So what I love about this is it's creamy, it's rich, it works really well, and of course, what I love is just pairing it with a loofah and really scrubbing the body. I really think that exfoliating while cleaning is like the most important part. If you are just washing yourself with your hands, let's turn that off. Let's 
let's change that. It's time to start doing it with some sort of exfoliating glove, a loofah, or any type of item that's gonna help you really get yourself cleaner better. Ever since I've been cleaning myself with these types of products, I've noticed a massive difference in the way my skin looks. And I know it's it's an over-the-counter product. It's not like incredible technology, but what I need is something that smells good, feels good, gets me clean, and makes me feel smooth. This does it all, so that's all I care about. Okay, so now we're gonna talk about ingrowns, strawberry legs, anything that has to do with razor bumps or just anywhere on your body where you're feeling like you need a little bit of a bump erasing. This right here is the real deal. It's the first Aid Beauty Bump Eraser Body Scrub. So you guys know I'm obsessed with exfoliating. I'm obsessed with scrubs in general. Like I love scrubs, but this one actually targets those issues. So it targets really getting the bumps and the unwanted texture that you don't want to your skin. So this is what the product looks like. Now where I like to apply this is in like my V area and I like to apply this to my legs and my arms in areas where I tend to get razor bumps or any type of like shaving acne. So I'll just show you guys what it looks like. So it's kind of like a sandy feel. You guys see that? It's so great, like it really exfoliates the skin well. It's literally like sand, and what's so important is it's a chemical and a physical exfoliant. So it's not just physical, it's chemical and it's physical. This fast-acting resurfacing body treatment contains chemical and physical exfoliators that work well together to deliver the benefits of a chemical peel and a microdermabrasion at once. Glycolic and lactic acids at a combined level of 10% helps loosen skin's top level Layer and decongest pores. Guys, this is what you guys need to really get the exfoliation that you want. You want to look for exfoliations that have a chemical exfoliant in it, not just a physical. Physical scrubs are great, but chemical exfoliation helps so much better. It just really gets it. Like it just gets under the skin. It treats whatever you have wrong. So I like to use this in everywhere that I shave in the crevices, if you know what I mean, on the armpits, on the arms. And I've been noticing my skin is like so much softer and just amazing. Okay, so this is a life-changing, thing to have in your shower. So this is a cellulite buffering exfoliating tool. I like to use this on my bum, on the back of my legs, behind my knees, on my arms, because honestly, guys, I have cellulite everywhere. It's just a part of being a woman. It's okay. You don't have to feel shame about it. But if you want to help treat it or just make it look a little bit nicer and smoother, this right here is amazing. I actually picked this up at Ulta. It kind of has like a soapy feeling texture to it, and it's just really great at just scrubbing the body well. Any type of dry Dry brushing, scrubbing, exfoliating, that's more of like a textured type of item is great. You're just literally gonna, it hurts, it does. It feels really good, like it feels like it's working. So it just kind of helps exfoliate that skin and after like doing those two things, my skin feels sickening. Like I'm talking about softer than anybody else I've ever felt. But as of right now, the past few weeks I've been using it, I've been obsessed with it. Okay, and a game changer that I've talked about a million times, but I think it's really important and crucial for all of my ladies that struggle with dry skin is the Nivea In Shower Body Lotion 24 Hour Plus Moisture. Okay, so what I love about this Nivea In Shower Body Lotion is it helps with dry skin. You don't wanna get out of the shower, put your towel on, dry yourself, and you're just kind of feeling a little bit like a Brillo pad or just like your like, skin is scratchy because honestly, you need some sort of moisture. So what I like to do is right before I turn off the water, I will literally lather my body in this lotion. It's very crusty, guys. Like, I... <laughs> I use this, what the heck? I, I did not expect for it to look that bad. But yeah, I will lather it over my body. You literally rinse it with the water and then you get out and your skin feels like butter. Like it feels amazing. You don't even need to put lotion on when you get out of the shower, but you guys know me, I'm extra, I'll do it anyways. When I'm struggling with dry patches, sometimes I'll get a dry patch on my stomach or my arms and I need just an extra layer of moisturizer that's just going to make everything feel smoother when I get out of the shower. So this is a crucial part of my every single day routine and I love it. And last but not least, body oil. Right before bed, it's nice to just put a little bit of body oil on your feet, your hands, your arms, your legs, maybe even put a sock over your feet so that you can really let your body soak it up. I love lotion, lotion works amazing, but sometimes body oil just makes me feel like it's doing the same thing with a little less thickness. Like it's just more, I don't know, like it just doesn't feel as obnoxious sometimes. I love it, I put it on all the time. I always like to use it if I'm wearing a dress and I'm showing my legs or anything that's just going to be showing your skin in any way. Body oil 
oil is like an all around amazing thing for moisturizing and for looks. I love it. I think it makes me look super shiny. It's a game changer. This one right here is the Kin Care Peaches and Cream Body Oil. I love this one because of the applicator. Personally, I just think it's like really easy to use and it's less messy than like a cap that like opens up. But honestly, you can use any body oil. I don't like prefer one over the other. As long as it smells good and it feels good, I'm obsessed with it. Okay guys, so that is pretty much my seven steps that I use either daily, weekly, or monthly on a nightly basis so that I can really look and feel great. And guys, like it is a game changer to take care of your body on your skin, to keep it hairless, bump free, feeling great, no texture, and just looking so much smoother. Okay guys, if you have any other questions, make sure that you guys leave a comment down below, give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe, and let me know what kind of videos you guys want from me. And I love you guys so much. I'll see you guys in the next one. Mwah. Bye guys. Don't forget to use my code HAI50 at Kenzie.com so that you guys can pick up your own laser device for at home.